All right, out here. Um, I'm gonna replace the fan belts. I was trying to do a, a live stream earlier on YouTube and it wasn't working. And I actually, I've already made a video with the other camera, but it just didn't turn out very good. So I'm gonna go ahead and these are the new belts that I put on. And they're not new, new. They are uh, spare belts that I carry, but they're still in good shape. Um, the belts that I took off, let me see if I can find them here real quick. The belts I took off, or what did I do with them? Hang on, hang, hang on a second. Let me find it. Here they are. So the belts I took off. I was doing a post-trip inspection on my truck, and there was a. Hang on a second. There it is. There was a uh, crack in the belt. Hang on. Let me find it. Let's see. It wasn't that one. There's two belts on the system. Um, there it is. I don't know if you can see it right there. Let's see if we can get it. But there was a crack in the belt right there. So I was afraid that that belt was going to break. So, so I was trying to do a live stream, but it didn't work out very good. So uh, I thought I would go ahead and make a video. And then I was using my other cheap camera, and that didn't work out either. So I'm back at it. So it only takes me about 10 minutes to uh, replace these belts. So what we're going to do is I'm going to show you how I do it. It's very simple. Um, we're going to do loosen up this bolt. We're going to loosen up that bolt right there. And then there is an adjusting rod right here that we're going to loosen up. And then that way the belts will be loose. The alternator will tilt forward. And then we're going to take the belts and um, uh, loop it around the fan blades. Uh, so, all right, let me uh, get set up. It only takes two wrenches. Uh, this is this is this is all you need right here: three quarter inch wrench and a socket. So, so here we go. Let's see here, there we go. All right. Now I don't know if it. You know, if the guy kind of maybe broke it when putting the alternator on or or what. But uh, after I took them off, I kind of inspected it. And those belts were in pretty bad shape. Not bad shape, but it was time to, uh, to change them. Now, like I said, I've already done this once today. This is super easy to do. And uh, let me make sure you guys can see what's going on. Yeah. So I loosen up this bolt right here. We're going to loosen up this one right there and then there's one in the back right here that we're going to get to get it up under here. Let me get the wrench. Righty tighty, lefty loosey. Hang on a second. There it goes. All right. So those are loose. Now we're going to go up on the top up here, and I'll show you the adjusting rod. Tighten it up. Okay. Here we are at the top. Now, see this rod right here? This adjusting rod. So all we got to do. Loosen that up there. So, and I just noticed my socket right there. Okay, let me, let me go ahead and set you guys up here. All right, so just loosen this up here. And I think the guy, when I put the had the alternator put on, he put some BB blaster on everything because uh, everything is nice and loose. Now I need to just move this. Hopefully, there it goes. All right, 
And then we're just gonna take and adjust this down like this. And then, like I said, I've already put these on, but I wanted to show you guys how it was done because I thought I would. And I was using that other camera and I, I think uh, I think I'm gonna upgrade cameras this week if I can find a place. Uh, I'm gonna go get another camera. So, so belts are loose. Now what we're gonna do is they're loose. Is you just take them and you loop them around the fan blades all the way around like this. So, and that's all you have to do is just loop them around like that. So. We'll go that far, and here, let me show you. Let me show you here. So this, the belts are off, and then you just loop it around the fan blades. And then you got the tensioning bolt right here, the tightening bolt right there. I'll go over to the other side. Let me go to the other side and show you. So, over here on the other side, you can see the pulleys right up there. And the fan belts, you just loop them around the blades all the way around. So, we're gonna pretend we put those back, those are the new ones, put them back on. And come over here. See if I can do this one-handed. And we're just gonna loop them around the blades. And then put them in the grooves. And I'll tell you, one thing I like about this truck, it is super easy to work on. So, let me go ahead and set you guys up so you can watch. Alright, I got you guys set up. So like I was saying, is uh, the one thing about this truck with the big hood like this, it is super easy to work on. Um, as you see, it only takes me a couple minutes to uh, to replace these belts. Um, the, the newer trucks with all the aerodynamics on them, you spend a couple hours just getting everything out of the way. Just so you can get to everything. right groove there it goes all right that one's in that groove and that one's in the groove and we just got to tighten up the bolts here a little bit yeah I was trying to do that live stream I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to ask trucker who I don't know if you guys follow him or not but he's a pretty good guy I like his videos he, uh, he does live stream quite a bit. He does it on the mobile app too, so I gotta figure out how, how he does that because I think that's pretty cool. And I was trying to set it up to where we could do it out here, but uh, it just wasn't working too good. So. so I decided to go ahead and make just a regular, regular video. And like I said, I've already done this once, but this is so easy, I don't mind doing it again. So what I'm doing is just uh, adjusting the bolts on the tensioner, just to kind of get an idea of, uh, so I can start tightening it up to where it needs to be. And just these two bolts, like I said, all you need is just a couple wrenches. Super, super easy. Now, if I was to go into a shop and have a shop do this, you'd be looking at a couple hundred dollars to, uh, to get this done. So, uh, this actually works out pretty good. And let me turn you guys just a little bit. Maybe hopefully you can see what's going on. So, uh, right now I'm just kind of adjusting the bolts here to make sure I get the tension on the belts. We're over here in Lodi, Ohio. We're about 10 miles from where we gotta pick up our load tomorrow morning. It's been a busy, uh, busy weekend. Um, 
I think the last time I talked to you guys was Thursday over in um, Indiana. I took uh, the bars up to uh, uh, Wisconsin and that turned into a little bit of issue up there. I didn't check in the right way and then they weren't going to unload me and you know all these places have a different uh, different uh, you know way to check in and stuff so it was kind of interesting all right all right let me get down here so we got we got the bars delivered uh, Friday about two o'clock our appointment was at 12 15 so we made our appointment time and uh, that went good and then we went and got reloaded skidded coils going to Jefferson Ohio delivered those this morning and that went good so uh, we are uh, going to pick up some uh, roofing shingles tomorrow morning early uh, take them 140 miles to a place in Ohio and then um, from there we're uh, going to go pick up uh, some tubing out of Elkhart, Indiana and take that to uh, St. Louis. So we got a busy week ahead of us, which is a good thing. So I think, and right now I'm just tightening up bolts right now, to make sure everything's good and snug. Good. That one's good. One more. One more. Let's see if we can find this one. All right. That's it. Pretty easy. Not too bad at all. All right. Look at that. I think the camera's been on for 14 minutes. So you saw how easy that was. So checking the tension on the belts. Um, let's go ahead and crank her up. See what she looks like. We'll crank it up, see what she looks like after it runs a little bit. Double check everything. Oop. Crank it up, double check everything. All right, you ready? Here we go. It's a little cold right now, so I should run a little rough. Uh... Let's go ahead and give her a little gas. Go check the belts, see how the tension is on the belts. All right, everything looks good. I think we're going to be all right. Double check. Let me get my wrench and just double check. I'm, I'm all, I'm always a worry wart that I forgot to tighten up something. So let me uh, get my wrench and double check that we've got everything tight. So anyway, and I always have a set of belts in my truck. Um, I uh, even if they're used belts, I always have a set of belts in my truck. Now these belts down here, these belts right here, 
are a little harder to change um, they take a little bit longer but they can be done it can be done it just takes a little bit longer these belts for the this is runs the air conditioner and the uh, alternator these belts here are uh, super easy super super easy so okay let's call it quits um, once again this is the third time I've done tried this so hopefully it turned out good this time thanks for watching and uh, talk to you guys later